Hi everyone, this is Phil from It Gaming, and today I'm going to show you how to not get killed by invisible warriors in Elden Ring. The invisible warriors are located in Ordina Liturgical Town, and Ordina Liturgical Town is located in the northern part of the map, pretty much dead center north of the map. Now, when you get here, you're going to have to go into the Ever Jail of Ordina Liturgical Town, and which is basically the shadowy Nether Realm version of the zone. And when you get in there, you're going to have to try to find four different candles to light. And that actually isn't very hard. There's a little bit of jumping involved, but these guys, these guys are the problem because they're absolutely invisible, they're impossible to see, and they're very likely to one-shot you unless you're wearing really, really thick armor. So there has to be a way to. Spot these guys before they kill you, and indeed there is, but it's actually not very intuitive. What you're going to need is a torch, and not just any torch, you will need to have the Sentry's Torch. Fortunately, if you don't have one, you can purchase one at a merchant, and that merchant is located at the Hermit Merchant's Shack, north of the capital. So once you go there, also bring with you 7,000 runes, because apparently torches are rather expensive. So when you've purchased it, uh, equip it probably in your offhand, because I'm assuming you don't want to use it as your primary weapon. I also recommend using a talisman like the Ritual Shield Talisman, which will reduce the amount of damage you take on your first hit, provided you're at full health. Now, when you have the torch in your offhand or in your main hand, the invisible warriors will become visible. And now, their moveset changes. They're not immediately going to try to backstab you. And uh, now they're basically just a regular Elden Ring enemy. They're dangerous, but nowhere near as dangerous as they were before. Finally, it's important to note that you don't need to keep holding on to the torch after the enemy has become visible, so you can go to two-hand if you wish to. Like, say, for example, you're like me, and you main Moonvale, and you're actually kind of trash at the game. Do you have any more tips about invisible warriors in Elden Ring? Tell us what they are in the comments below. If you found this video useful, please feel free to leave a like, comment, or subscribe to the channel. And as always, have fun out there.